Who was the unbeatable emperor of history? The answer might surprise you. Today, we're introducing you to a historical enigma, a figure who has intrigued scholars and history enthusiasts across centuries. Samrat Ashok, the third emperor of the Mauryan dynasty. Born into the royal lineage, Ashok's early life was steeped in the teachings of strategy, diplomacy and warfare. His ascension to the throne was a natural progression, yet his reign was anything but ordinary. Known for his mighty strength and strategic acumen, Ashok was a force to be reckoned with on the battlefield. His reputation as a fierce warrior was cemented with the significant military conquest, the Kalinga War, a battle that changed the course of his life and the history of India. A ruthless warrior, a wise ruler, a compassionate human, Samrat Ashok was all this and more. His story is one of power, transformation and legacy. But that's a tale for another time. But what turned this ruthless warrior into a peace-loving emperor, one might wonder. The answer lies in the aftermath of the brutal Kalinga War. This war was a turning point, a watershed moment in Ashok's life. The magnitude of destruction, the staggering loss of life, painted a picture of horror that deeply affected him. The rivers of blood and the cries of the wounded haunted his conscience, leaving him distraught and remorseful. This profound sorrow led him to the path of Buddhism, a faith that emphasizes compassion and non-violence. Embracing Buddhism brought about a remarkable transformation in Ashok. The once formidable warrior now became a beacon of peace and tranquility. His approach to governance underwent a drastic change, prioritizing welfare over warfare. His reign soon ushered in an era of peace and prosperity, unheard of in those turbulent times. The mighty warrior had evolved into a benevolent ruler, guided by the teachings of Buddha. From a battlefield stained with blood emerged a ruler with a heart of gold. So what did this remarkable ruler leave behind? Well, Ashok's reign was marked by an array of achievements, each more impressive than the last. His policy of Dhamma, a code of ethical conduct, became the backbone of his governance, emphasizing peace, harmony and respect for all life. But his influence didn't stop at policy. He left behind the Ashokan edicts, a series of decrees carved into stone and pillars across his empire. These edicts, still visible today, echo his commitment to justice, compassion, and the welfare of his subjects. Ashok also played a pivotal role in spreading Buddhism. His adopted faith, his efforts took the religion beyond the Indian subcontinent, helping it gain a global footprint. And let's not forget his contributions to art and architecture. The Ashokan pillars with their intricate carvings and majestic lions are a testament to the artistic brilliance of his era. Samrat Ashok, a ruler who wielded the sword and the pen with equal mastery left an indelible mark on the annals of history.